mutation in a gene of chromosome 3 could induce an alteration in the sodium channels, an important part of the electronic activity of our heart. In young people, it could cause unexpected palpitations, dizziness, and unconsciousness, which is known as syncope. What is happening is that the heart can't pump blood to the brain correctly. Recovery is usually spontaneous, but a fatal outcome may also happen. That is what we know as Brugada syndrome, an inherited disease that causes sudden death and, in the first hours, can only be remedied with a defibrillator. We are in the Plaza of Catalunya, in the Cor de Barcelona. We are cardiologists and we thought it was very good to come here, precisely in the Cor de Barcelona, to explain our investigations about the diseases cardiovascular and, concretely, the death of the heart and the arrhythmias cardiac. Ramon and Josep Brugada are brothers and are doctors, both of them expert researchers in sudden death. With their third brother, they identified in 1992 what scientists call the Brugada syndrome, an inherited sudden death disease. In Europe, sudden death kills four times more people than car accidents. In Spain, 12% of annual deaths are sudden deaths. 80% of these deaths are caused by coronary obstructions because of an unhealthy lifestyle, but the other percentages are related to genetics. L'altre 20%, sobretot amb la gent jove, veiem que estan causades sobretot per malalties genètiques, malalties familiars, hereditàries, lo qual vol dir doncs que al diagnosticar una persona a la família amb aquesta malaltia, hem de tenir en compte que hi pot haver altres familiars també afectats. Genetic alterations related to sudden death could identify with a simple and specific medical examination. Clinical controls are specifically designed for young people, boys and girls, who play sports many hours a day or in an intense way. A vegades veiem esportistes de molt alt nivell que pateixen una mort sobtada, i pateixen una mort sobtada possiblement perquè el seu cor no estava preparat per aguantar aquest esport tan intens. Si un vol fer esport, s'ha de fer amb seguretat, s'ha de fer havent verificat que el nostre cor aguanta i aguantarà aquell exercici o aquell esforç extrem que li volem fer tenir. When the heart attack is inevitable, having a defibrillator near the patient could save their life. In Girona, they have installed defibrillators everywhere, and during 2013, 10 people survived sudden death, even a 14-year-old boy. Having defibrillators close by, eating a healthy diet, and doing medical exams, in addition to scientific research, will ensure our lives will not stop suddenly. La mort sobtada fa 20 anys a les Olimpíades de Barcelona no coneixien absolutament res de la genètica de les morts sobtades dels joves. En aquests darrers 20 anys, gràcies a la investigació, Ara hem pogut esbrinar que hi ha més d'un centenar de gens associats a mort sobtada i podem esbrinar realment un percentatge molt important de les causes de mort sobtada a la gent jove.